The first step to making your uh, artist palettes cutting board is going to make your cam.com file open SVG and open the file that you downloaded from the site. Once you open it, you can hit the uh, minus sign and drag your piece to the origin point. Once you're there, you can use this hand to move around and zoom back in with this plus sign. Click back to the cursor and you'll be able to begin highlighting your lines. So the outside here is going to be a profile cut, so go to cam, profile operation, and uh, name it something that you'll remember. The tool diameter we're using is point one two five. Our target depth is going to be negative point seven six because we want it to go all the way through the material. The outside means that we want the bit to follow the outside of the cutting path. So we're going to stick with the outside for this particular cut. The safety height is going to be point one two five. Uh, the step down is going to be point zero three one two five. Feed rate of thirty. Plunge rate of ten. So now we're going to do this inside circle, the little thumb hole. Uh, that's also going to be a profile operation. So again, name it so you'll be able to tell them apart. The tool diameter is the same, 0.125. The target depth is also the same as before, negative 0.76. Um, and before we wanted it on the outside, this time we actually want it on the inside, so it becomes that same shape that you see um, in the file. So 0.125 is the safety height. A step down is the same, 0 0.03125, feed rate of 30, plunge rate of 10. Okay, now you're ready to calculate all, so CAM, uh, calculate all. And now the line you see is actually where your uh, the bit is going to travel. So we need to add tabs to both of these because you have to add tabs to every profile operation. So let's add tabs. I'm going to say, uh, let's see, we'll do uh, add a tab every 0 0.1, 0 0.5 of an inch. Um, that's probably too many. You can kind of click on them, move them around. Um, once they're highlighted, you can delete them. So I'm probably only going to need one. Move it to a place that seems logical. Um, highlight the outside profile cut, and then we're going to do the same thing. So it's going to be add tabs to selected. Um, the standard seems pretty good for that. Kind of arrange them in a way that makes sense, a triangle formation probably ideal. And then once that looks good, uh, go to CAM, export G-code. So we want the inside profile to um, cut first, so you highlight it, click the little plus sign, highlight them all, and export your G-code. Uh, again, name it something you'll remember. And then the next step is to secure your material and open up the NC file it's going to generate into a G-code sender.